I didn't want to say this on September 11th because this obviously has such huge global implications. It's also true that those big global events have personal meaning to us because we're individuals living in the world. Our parents' generation talked about where were you when Martin Luther King was shot, when Malcolm X was shot. In 20 years, people will be talking about where were you during the pandemic. For me, September 11th, 2001 was really big as a Muslim, but also as a musician. I was working that day at Fifth Element Record Shop in Minneapolis, and because of what had happened, the buses weren't running. Musab came and picked me up and drove me to the shop. Jay-Z's Blueprint album had dropped that day, and so we drove around the city, listened to that album multiple times. Like a lot of people in hip-hop, that album had a huge impact on me. It felt like that whole shiny suit era might be over with and we might be back to hip hop music being number one that makes sense to me. The next day I left to go do a regional run of shows, my first time performing outside of Minneapolis. And I opened for Idea and Abilities, Mr. Liv, Aesop Rock was supposed to be on the tour but he wasn't able to be there and Cannibal Ox. Cannibal Ox had dropped an album a month or so prior called The Cold Vein. My mind and heart and in my life, that album was as weighty as Jay-Z's Blueprint album. It was an album in underground independent hip hop that stood out to me because it made sense to me, the same way the Jay-Z Blueprint album made sense to me in mainstream rap. So I went out on tour with them and Vast Air from Cannibal Ox really treated me like a peer, like a colleague, like a brother. So a couple months later when I started making my debut album, the first song that I made was Room With A View. It sounds like a beat from the Blueprint album with rhymes from Vast Air on the Cannibal Ox album. Like when I close my eyes, I can hear my lines from that song in Vast Air's voice. We don't have bar mitzvahs. We become men the first time my father hits us and we don't open gifts up. So this felt like a great time to sit down with my brother Vast Air, just do what we do on the podcast, which is talk about what it all means. 